Survivor Series is November 20th. And um, this was supposed to be uploaded a few days ago, so sorry for the inconvenience. And But um, for the first, uh, well, actually not for the first time, but uh, the first Survivor Series matchup, like traditional 5-on-5, five five, has finally been made a few days ago as of Monday Night Raw. Or SmackDown, I don't remember which. But it is uh, Team Orton versus Team Barrett. And to be honest, a lot of these, uh, and I'll just say the teams right now representing Team Orton, and of course, Captain Randy Orton, uh, Sin Cara, what happened to the tag champions, Kobe Kingston, Sheamus, and uh, Mason Ryan. And for Team Barrett, Captain, of course, Wade Barrett, uh, Christian, Jack Swagger, the Intercontinental Champion, Cody Rhodes, and Hunico. Now, there's a lot of people... Getting back into pay per view, uh, getting back into pay per views, as of late, because uh, right now there's like you know a few things of history right now for Vengeance that still goes back to Vengeance, and even back to the uh, previous pay per view, whatever, whichever one it was, which was which had the uh, Sin Cara versus Sin Cara match. But, um, you know, uh, for a course of Randy Orton and Cody Rhodes had that uh, Intercontinental title match. Well, actually, it wasn't an Intercontinental title match at Vengeance, but it should have been. And what also should have been was the uh, the street fight they had on SmackDown, which was probably a match of the year candidate, if I do this on myself. Both could have been for the title, but then again, I'm not booking WWE. So, whatever. That would be a hell of a title match, though. I'll tell you that much. Might even... Might even uh, Get Orton down a few pegs out of the main event spot so we can have like new stars, uh, you know, go for that title. But I digress also with uh, Swagger and Kofi. Uh, they've been in tag team wars of the past couple months for the tag titles, including Badget Vengeance. But since Evan Bourne is suspended for uh, his first wellness policy violation, a, a lot of suspensions not going on right now, really. But, weird. Um, uh, what was I saying? But, uh, so yeah, I guess they have to make Kofi uh, with singles competitors, thus kind of breaking the 30-day title defense rule because uh, Evan Bourne is suspended for 30 days. Thus, I don't know if they would strip him of the belts when he comes back or defend them right when he comes back and say, oh, it was because of the suspension or whatever. And, uh, let me see. Who else? Because Sheamus and Christian had a feud that went even before Hell in a Cell. So I'm not even going to touch that one. And, uh, of course, Wade Barrett. Um, Hunico, technically. Uh, Sin Cara. And uh, Mason Ryan are new to the pay-per-view scene right now, but it's great to see them back on pay-per-view. And, uh, to be honest, with a Survivor Series matchup, you really can't predict who will win this type of match, because especially with the odds of this matchup, because it can you can go to four on three, three on two, even five on one, which is horrible <laughs> for that person. But uh, yeah, Survivor Series matches have been going on for what twenty five years now. This as a, the pay per views going on for that long. As so as these traditional matches, which originally had four-on-four four matches instead of five-on-five, five, which was introduced really for not till a long time, actually. Maybe 90s at, or 2000s at best. Not quite sure. But uh, it's, it's, you know, a lot different because normally, okay, you have this opinion because this person would win and this person could lose. or there's, but it, there's so many possibilities, especially since... Orton has been a sole survivor on several Survivor Series teams as of as over the past few years. And the rest of them really don't have that much experience in Survivor Series matches, so this is pretty much a toss-up going either way. But Survivor Series is November 20th, and hopefully the best team will win, or maybe a sole survivor.